Transporting foil and equipment from the parking lot to the beach can be a challenge at times, especially using e-foil and equipment with the added weight of the battery. So to help with this issue, a few companies have designed some really nice transport carts, but in my opinion, they can be a bit expensive. Now there are some less expensive solutions like kayak or even gardening carts. And I've used a gardening cart myself, but I found that it was heavy and it took up a lot of space and it also got rusty. So I decided to see if I could build my own smaller rust proof cart using PVC pipe. To get started, I ordered some balloon sand tires and cotter pins on Amazon. Next, I made a trip to my local Home Depot for the PVC pipe. And I used five one and a quarter inch tees, eight one and a quarter inch three-way elbows, one one and a quarter inch cap, one half inch 10 foot pipe for the axle. And then I also used two one inch 10 foot pipes. I cut the one inch pipe first into pieces for the frame and I used four one and a half foot pieces for the top and bottom of the front and the back of the frame. I then cut four two foot pieces for the length of the top and the bottom of the frame. And then I cut four eight inch pieces for the risers connecting the top and the bottom of the frame. I then assembled all the pieces. I ended up using small self-tapping screws to secure everything, but glue can probably be used just as well. Once the frame was assembled, I drilled two holes at the rear bottom of the frame, and then I used the half inch pipe as the axle and cut it to 37 inches. I next drilled small holes on the axle pipe for the cotter pins, both on the inside and the outside of where the tires would be placed. I placed the tires on the axle and inserted the cotter pins in both the inside and the outside holes. Now to make a handle for the cart, I drilled a hole in the center of the front of the top of the frame and inserted a nylon strap that I had laying around. I then cut a six inch piece of the half inch pipe and passed one end of the nylon strap through it, connecting it to the other end. And then I ultimately tied off both ends using a zip tie and so that was pretty much it uh the cart works great and it holds a fair amount of weight uh considering it's just pvc pipe it's completely waterproof doesn't take up a lot of space and is virtually rust proof um, except for the metal cotter pins obviously the total cost of the parts was 172 dollars so it's not super cheap but it worked well for my budget and achieved what i needed it to do so if you have any specific questions about the cart just leave those in the comment section be happy to answer them. I appreciate you watching and take care.